Hey everyone, it's Vera here. I am excited to share with you what I got my kids for Christmas this year on 2023. This is the only opportunity I can sit down, the sun is shining, my toddler is sleeping, my boys are having quiet time so I can quickly share all the gifts and hopefully no one sneaks in. So this year, I think I'm gonna say is the most presents I ever got them or purchased. I feel like I spent the most money this year. Other years, I've been more minimal and I think it's just because when they're younger, they don't know what they want and also anything can like make them happy. But I guess the older they get, they know what they want. They ask for a certain presence. So I think this is why I spent more um, and I guess the older are the more exciting like my two-year-old I know she doesn't really care for anything doesn't specifically ask for anything so it's like you don't have to get something so pricey or grand for them I have two boys eight years old and five years old and then a girl who's two okay so I'm gonna start with my oldest the three things that I really wanted uh, specifically for all of my kids is something to read a book with my oldest I someone recommended these books here um, there's one of escape to Titanic and then escape to tombs of Egypt and this is more like educational reading and because I homeschool this was just a perfect book to have learning kind of like the history as well he's starting to read chapter books and so the reading is uh, it's enough reading that will be challenging but then also there's pictures so I hope you'll enjoy it. It's kind of like a novel but also you get to write in it. So those are the two books that he's gonna get. Um, if it fits in a stocking I'll put it in a stocking if not I'll just wrap it in the present. And then my oldest just loves geography and just landmarks and uh, for his birthday he got to go to see a tower. That was his wish. We live close to Toronto so he got to go to CN Tower and he's just crazy for it. He says that's like his favorite thing he's done in his life. So I saw this in Mastermind Toy Store and I thought he's gonna love it. It is a CN Tower to build. It's not like a Lego company, so I don't know how good this company is. It's called Dragon Block. So I don't know if the instructions are good. I've never bought anything from this company. But they actually have a whole bunch of different buildings. Like there's the White House, there's Parliament Building, there's like the Eiffel Tower. Um, it is 10 plus, so he might need help. I don't know how challenging it's gonna be, but I don't mind helping. I feel like it's gonna be fun family thing. But I think he is gonna be really surprised about this. Years ago, when he was like two years old, I had the this camera. The instant camera and of course he was little and like playing with him broke and I just thought it would be fun for him to have this like actually his own now and he never asked for this so this is also gonna be a big surprise for him there's like 20 um, sheets 20 sheets here and I got this in Amazon just easier that way it was a bit actually cheaper in Amazon than like going to the store in Walmart so yeah he's very like into taking pictures and doing little videos so I think this will be just fun to have for him I hope he I hope he's happy with it but then I feel like this gift is like perfect for any age that's like older kids because I mean who doesn't love taking pictures with their friends or something it's everything that I bought for him in my previous other videos I usually do mention what the my kids get from their grandparents because I do help them and give them ideas of what to get and um, my eight-year-old actually asked for a bitsy and it's right here I'll display it but I guess it's the new popular thing it's kind of like a Tamagotchi but it's like a big one he saw it in the Amazon magazine wish list so he asked for it so his grandma did buy that for him so he will be getting that and she actually bought it for my five-year-old as well because she knows that sometimes they fight even though my five-year-old never asked for it but they're gonna have two of them I am so thirsty I'm not used to talking. Also, my eight-year-old just loves making money. He's always helping with chores and um, saving up money for something for the future, he says. So I thought the perfect gift for him would be something with money. And I saw 
Clutterbug, the YouTuber Clutterbug, she showed this gift idea where you put a um, bunch of bills in this like Kleenex box and you pull it up. So I told my mother-in-law to make that. So she has made that for him for Christmas and I think he's gonna love that. So with my five-year-old, he is obsessed with Mario and he loves playing his Nintendo Switch as well. My boys play Nintendo Switch. So there's the new Mario Wonder game out. So I got that him. I got that for him. It's supposed to come in two days, so I can't show you it, but this is just how the game looks. Um, I heard that the new, it's a brand new game that just came out and it's pretty easy because I heard some Mario games are pretty hard for little kids. So I'm hoping this one he'll be able to do. I've heard really good reviews. He plays Mario Kart and really good with it. And he's been really asking for a Mario game after the Mario movie came out. So yeah, he loves Mario. Um, and I also got him a book for him is a Mario book and this is like a book that I'm gonna read to him because he's not really good at reading it or his brother can read it for him but this will be just a nice bedtime story and then I also got him this book that says who farted and I feel like if you are a mom of boys you just know they love to talk about farting and just potty words um, so apparently in this book you're supposed to try to find like the green cloud kind of thing <laughs> and figure out fine yeah like here it is this dog farted so you have to just spot whoever farted and apparently it's gonna the reviews are the kids are gonna laugh and love to look through this book so yeah I got him that book two books for him and then because my oldest is getting like a the CN Tower kind of Lego thing he really wanted to have a spaceship so I got him this uh, three-in-one like Lego spaceship kind of thing it can be also an astronaut and then this is a rocket um, it's not that big and it was kind of cheap comparing to the other uh, gift I have for my oldest but the thing is I think they do have like a huge spaceship or something rocket but it's like really expensive over a hundred and it's hard so I know this one he'll be able to build so I got him that and I know he'll be happy with that my five-year-old loves Lego that's like one of his top toys that he likes to play with like I mentioned my five-year-old loves Mario he saw in an Amazon wish list magazine the Mario castle kind of play set so his grandma purchased that um, in Walmart it's actually kind of hard to find it's a specific one in Amazon they have like Bowser's and this other castle but the specific one he has like here's a picture it's in Walmart online only um, and it comes with some characters and I also um, ordered this was to come a first time ever I got an advent calendar I've never done those before and there's a Mario advent calendar it's pretty pricey but it comes each day when you open it, it comes with little characters so I thought that was really cool so in December 1st, we're going to start opening that every day and he's going to have all these little characters. And then on Christmas, when he gets his present, he's going to have a lot of characters to play with his castle. So I think it's going to be fun and I, I hope he loves it. Okay, now for my two-year-old, um, so the book I got for her is a baby shark book. She loves baby shark. I mean, which, which toddler doesn't? I actually was trying to find like baby shark like little toys, but it's like really hard to find. I don't see it anywhere in the store. And in Amazon, they have like stuffies, but I don't want stuffies. So I don't know. If anyone knows where to buy baby shark toys, let me know. <laughs> I got her from Amazon a little kitty cat. And I just I just feel like a little pet is like the cutest thing for toddlers. So, uh, this kitty cat meows and walks and lays. So I just feel like this is like a fun toddler toy. Um, my two-year-old is like, loves baby dolls. She has so many, which... She probably doesn't need any more, <laughs> but I just saw this and thought it was so cute. It's like a bath baby doll and it's like a little swan. It's like the windows kind of, it's a little swan that floats in the water and it comes with like a little baby that's it's kind of like a floaty. It's bath time baby. And I don't know. I just thought that would be really cute for the summer to swim with and then just put in her bathtub because she just needs some bath toys. Um, so yeah. I got this at Marshall's because my two-year-old has so many dolls I uh, gave an idea for the grandma to get a little like baby crib because she doesn't have that many accessories for her babies she does have a high chair and a stroller um, but she doesn't have like a baby crib so um, 
she got a little baby crib like white one from Amazon it was a picture so yeah she'll get that from her grandma I got all of my kids uh, them a blanket I just thought it'd be so cute to have a blanket I got pink blue and green um, for them because sometimes when we're sitting in the in the couch a blanket they're fighting over a blanket and they're like this is my blanket so I thought if they have their own personal uh, blanket then they can't fight over it when they're sitting on the couch or in bed so yeah it has their name on it and I don't know it's so cute so with for my daughter I chose like a handwritten on her name and a heart and then there's this one Luca and I got this online at some shop I actually like it was an ad and I clicked on it sometimes it's risky to do ads because you never know they might be like fake or something but luckily this was real but it did take a really long time like about three weeks so if you're interested in these kind of blankets you gotta like order them now so that we make it for Christmas because it took a long time um, let me open it to feel it because I haven't opened it so I don't want to ruin oh it's really soft it's kind of like this velvety material so there it is. It's quite small, actually. I expect it to be bigger, unless I, I don't know if they have sizes. I need to check again. It's pretty small, actually. It's kind of like a baby blanket. <laughs> I would say, like, it's not that big. That might have been a flop. Oh, well. <laughs> Anyways, if anyone wants small blankets, I don't know. I have to check the site if they make them bigger or not. But yeah, that's the Christmas presents my kids are getting. And I hope you got some ideas from it if you don't know what to get your kids. Um, and I want to wish everyone a Merry Christmas. Um, and Happy New Year. And hopefully I will make some more videos. We will see. Bye.